the switch pod is an invention for vloggers from vlogger mode to tripod mode in seconds and we built it specifically for vloggers who travel a lot i mean this is slim look how slim it is An absolute journey and a half. Oh, he's jet lagged. I'll tell you that much. G'day, Internet Wants Dollar Tree. Welcome to today's episode or this week's episode of the vlog. So I'm back. Yes, I'm back in one of my favorite cities in the world, San Diego. San Diego! That's right, San Diego. I'm back for Social Media Marketing World 2019. And look, if you've been following my content for a while now, you'll know that uh, I've had some times here. Flashback. Okay, so I landed in Los Angeles like an hour ago. I'm very jet lagged. I was really jet lagged and I slept through the majority of Social Media Marketing World 2017. I spent 20 hours sleeping. It was a long nap. Okay, so we just found some seals. <laughs> There's a lot of them. I could not get over how bad they smell. Here's my new boy, Chris Covey. And he's like, you trying to fuck with some steaks? And I'm like, I can fuck with some steaks. End of flashback. This is my fourth year attending Social Media Marketing World. I'm super pumped to be back. I'm super pumped to see all my old friends and colleagues and meet new friends and new colleagues. I'm just so pumped that I'm here. Now, if you managed to watch the fourth or fifth ever episode of the vlog called Jet Lagged at Social Media Marketing World 2017 featuring Chris Covey, I basically slept through this conference, like literally slept through it since then. So for 2018 and for this year, I've learned from my mistakes from the past, I've made sure that I come at least a day or so in advance so that I have enough time to get over the jet lag because let me tell you, it's a pretty hectic commute. Perth's so isolated and I've spoke about how isolated Perth is, but just to give you an idea, to fly from Perth to San Diego. San Diego, San Diego. Look, if you're over that song already, look, let me tell you, you're gonna, you're gonna really, really enjoy the rest of what I've got in store because every single time I say San Diego, Maybe not, maybe not, but we'll see, we'll see. So I finally arrived in San Diego, it took me 36 hours. So anyways, with that said, I'm going to get my stuff set up, get through a bunch of work, because it's just turning business hours in Perth. I'm gonna catch up with a bunch of client work, which I've missed out on because of the massive long commute. Here's the thing, guys, like what I've learned is, yeah, traveling through so many different time zones, the best way to kind of push through the jet lag is to push through it. So I'm feeling pretty dead right now, and I'm forcing myself to stay up until at least about eight o'clock, nine o'clock tonight, so that when I do go to sleep, I'm kind of getting accustomed and acclimatized to this time zone as opposed to doing what I did in 2017 where I slept through the whole conference. Freaking idiot. So, you know, learning from my past mistakes. So yeah, I'm gonna get stuck into that. Real quick though, if you're not already subscribed, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Turn the bell notifications on so you get notified when I drop new videos, which is every single week. Thursdays, 6 a.m. Pacific, 9 a.m. Eastern, which works out to be 9 p.m. Australian Western Standard Time Zone. So this year, I'm really hoping to get at least one video out a week for the majority of this year. So we got that to look forward to. <laughs> anyway, I will see you soon. Thought it'd be rude not to give you a quick little room tour before I basically destroy <laughs> this place. Look, I'm super, super neat at home. So neat, so OCD. Everything's always organized. Everything's always in, in a place. But when I travel, let me tell ya, it is not a pretty sight. I basically am just like <laughs> to the entire room. So let's uh, have a quick look before it gets all gross. Ooh, shoot. All right, we've got the, uh, we've got the bed. Yes, yes, nice little bed. Very comfortable beds, can confirm. Have slept on them before, amazing. We've got the uh, little desk working area, which is super, super sweet, especially when you're trying to work and you're abroad. That's one big TV. Cool. I kind of like just like to get rid of everything that's kind of all set up neatly and only keep what is essential when I get set up in a room. So that's what's happening there. A bit of coffee for later. Oh, much more stuff over there. More bed action there. Some water. There's a wardrobe and you know, there's a bathroom. So room tour done. What happens every time I walk into a room, you know? That's amazing. Wow. Some uh, real life hustle right there. I love it. I love it. Subscribe. <laughs> Grab a sticker. Ah. You. Thank you. So I'm here at Social Media Marketing World in the networking plaza and there's this product called the Switch Pod that came out a while ago. It was launched on Kickstarter. I didn't get in. I think it's nine days left of the campaign at the time of me recording this video. But I'm at the booth and I just tried it out for the first time and look, I'm just so done with using my Gorilla Pod. It served its purpose, but it's just too clunky. It's too hard to like stabilize and like set up. It always just takes so long. And this Switch Pod, oh my, oh my God, it's just absolutely, absolutely incredible. And uh, let's just have a quick chat with one of the founders, Caleb. He's just busy with someone else right now, but uh, let's have a little chat to him. So I'm here 
with Caleb, co-founder of SwitchPod. Caleb, please just tell me, give me a quick little elevator pitch yeah. of why the SwitchPod is so sick. So we made it because I was really frustrated with the GorillaPod, Bendy Tripods, being able to switch between holding it into like a vlogging handheld mode and switching into tripod mode. So we started from the ground up. What can we make that can just do those two things really well, be able to switch between them really fast, hence the name SwitchPod, and that's why we made it. So we worked on it for over a year, showed it to creators at different events. Definitely had a lot of different prototypes, a lot of different changes that went into it, but what you see here is, is the final product. We're on Kickstarter right now, and then we'll be shipping retail all over the world right after that. And guys, I can confirm, what you see is what you get. I just tried it out for the first time, and it's it's so sick, like, so sick. Goodbye, GorillaPod. Hello, SwitchPod. All right, so we're here at Social Media Market World 2019 with the man, the legend himself, Mr. Pat Flynn. What's up? Uh, oh, dude, I'm doing awesome. Fantastic. Please tell me a bit about SwitchPod. So the SwitchPod is an invention for vloggers from vlogger mode tripod mode in seconds and we built it specifically for vloggers who travel a lot I mean this is slim look how slim it is it's a little side project that's kind of blown up right now and we're here to just serve creators and make creating easier you about 200,000 over your goal right uh, so our goal was a hundred thousand we reached that in 11 hours uh, which is pretty insane three hundred sixty thousand dollars pledged that's amazing so over four thousand Switch pods have been working because there's people ordering five. I'm like, oh my gosh, this is insane. Pat, he's practicing what he preaches because the riches are in the niches. Yes, absolutely. Thank you. All right, thanks very much, thanks. Pat. Appreciate it. Cheers. One of my favorite things about being at conferences is the fact that I get to meet up with some of my favorite brands, some of the platforms that I get to use every single day, and also get to hang out and meet up with the people behind those platforms. So let's go and check out Thinkific, which is the LMS, the learning management software, which I host Funnels 101 2.0 on. I tried so many other LMSs before using Thinkific and I've been with Thinkific now for three years. Absolutely love them. Amazing company, amazing platform with amazing people. Let's just go say hello to Rob and Andrea. Oh, there's Andrea. How's it going? <laughs> oh, yeah. Is that for me? Is that for me? Oh, it's my boy. Woo! <laughs> Cheers, bro. I'm all swagged out. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> I remember Parker from last year. Parker's the best. Little PTV. Let's go. Let's go. So Parker, oh, you now live in Los Angeles, eh? Yeah, I now live in Los Angeles, just living it up. Not as cool as you, but working on it. Oi, oi, look, he's way cooler than me. <laughs> Since it's all fake news, he's way cooler than me. <laughs> Sorry I missed you yesterday, bro. No, nah, it's all good. We're going to film some stuff today. Yes. We're about to make some bangers. I'm literally like some bangers. cold right now because I was outside, but you would think it'd be hot in San Diego, but it's not. But this is what I say for the vlog. It's <laughs> my boy. It's my boy. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Let's yeah. get that card number on video if you don't mind. <laughs> if we could, if we could, like, not do that. <laughs> guys, this guy's famous, just so you know. Yeah, he's famous. Shut your mouth, he's famous mate. in Australia. Shut your mouth, mate. He's very keen. Hey, mate. Hey. Two weeks later. Oh, what's up? Present day Paul here. So I didn't do a good enough job of capturing enough content when I was at Social Media Marketing World. So this is my attempt at stitching this whole episode together in post. So it's been two weeks since Social Media Marketing World 2019. Had the best time. I'm now in New York. I'm living and working here for a month out of the same co-working space we work that I worked out of two or so years ago. And look, I went to my first baseball game on the weekend. So a quick little flashback to that. Three drinks are done, we're late for the game. How late are we for the game, Nick? Uh, about an hour. An hour? An hour is. We made it. We are here. We're slightly delayed, but we are here. I don't know what we were doing, but the important thing is we're here. Shout out to Bank of America for uh, allowing this to happen. Always. Can we just appreciate this beautiful greenery? Wait, the views. First baseball game, the Yankee Stadium. It's, uh, it's not bad, it's not bad. So, how'd you find the game? Well, it's great other than us losing. We did lose, we did lose. The Yankees lost. It's not a good time. But... We'll bring it up to make up for it. That and... That in the middle of the cash in a game. Good friends. It wasn't a bad time. Just a bad outcome. Bad. See you soon. 
and we're back. It was lots and lots of fun. This episode basically brings us all up to speed in terms of what's happening in my real everyday life and a vlog being released within a week of those events happening. So that's where we're at now. So we've basically caught up, we're up to date with all the episodes. I'm super excited to bring you lots of adventures and stories from New York City over the next month. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. And look, apart from that, we'll cue the outro. My name is Paul Ramondo. If you're not already subscribed, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Turn the bell notifications on so you get notified when I drop new videos. And look, I'm excited for the next few episodes. It's gonna be so much fun. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you soon. Peace. understand.